Welcome to Andy's Garage, I'm Andy Phillips. Today I'm gonna to show you how to remove a stuck CD from your CD player. So let's go ahead and get started. To complete this video, all you need is a small flathead screwdriver, something small enough that it can slide into the CD to the actual slot without damaging anything. Now here's what we're dealing with. We have a CD where it's in the CD player and it's kind of lodged in there in the entrance. If you're dealing with a CD that's completely stuck in there due to a faulty CD player, then unfortunately you're gonna to have to remove that CD player from your actual vehicle, take it apart to remove your CD. In this case here, we're actually getting power from the CD player, so it is trying to eject it, but for whatever reason the CD is stuck in there and that can happen from either if you have an aftermarket label you put on there or anything that can just thicken the uh, thickness of the CD just enough it can cause it to get stuck in there. So that's what we're gonna be removing here at this point. If we push the eject button and listen closely, you can hear it trying to eject it. So we know for a fact that the CD player, the actual eject motor is working. It could be getting weak though, which could be causing it to get stuck, but we know for a fact that it is working, which is what we want it to be doing in order for this process to work. There's two ways that you can remove this. Number one, since we have enough slack showing, we could take a set of needle nose pliers and just gently pull it out. Now you would only do that if you can sacrifice your CD because you have a high chance of damaging it by doing that. In this case, we don't want to damage the CD, so I'm just going to take a very small screwdriver and put it on the edge of the CD itself. And we're going to gently lead it out as we push the eject button. So with that trying to push it out and us gently leading it out, that should get it out at that point. Gently going to insert this small flathead screwdriver just on the side. You don't want to damage anything in the process. To where we can get it on the side of the CD itself and gently lead it out. And as I lead it out, I'm going to push the eject button and that should pop it right out. What you don't want to have happen is have the CD go back in like it just did. Another thing you can do is gently put it right here on the top, and I mean gently, you don't want to scratch it, and gently pull it as you're hitting eject, and here it comes, do it again, and here it's starting to come out, we give it a little push, hit it again, and I'm going to get my fingers in here now, you can pull it. There we go. And it looks like the cause of this one is because it has an aftermarket label on the top of the CD. So that may have made it just a thick enough enough to get stuck in there, but nothing was damaged, the CD's out. Okay, well that pretty much wraps up this video. I hope this video helped you out. I hope it was informative for you. Please send me any questions, any comments. I would love to hear from you. As always, I appreciate all the support. So please like this video and subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next time.